Spirit. Hello, y'all. If this is your first time viewing my channel, please hit subscribe if I give you a message. If you watch it more than four or five minutes, please hit subscribe. I need to help, and I love you, and I hope that... Excuse me, spiritual burp. I hope that you all go after your dreams like I do, and that's why I need to help. Because all I'm asking for is a little subscribe, a view, and a like. That's all I need from you all, and I love you, and I hope I can help you. And who is this reading for today? Spirit say it. It is for a Libra. I just did Libra the other day. What else? Spirit. Spirit, who is it for today? Spirit. Oh, it's for Aries. I just did an Aries the other day, too. Oh, well, wow. oh, Gemini, I did Gemini. Taurus, I did Taurus. Aries, I did Aries. I just did Scorpio. <laughs> Sagittarius, I just did Sagittarius. Pisces, I just did Pisces. Where's Virgo? Where's Virgo? Where's Virgo? Where's Virgo? Here's Virgo. Here, we'll do Virgo today. Virgo. Here you go, Virgo. It took a long time, but I know what I've been doing, so sorry I had to do that. Oh, Spirit say let go. Oh, Virgo, you might need to let go of somebody as you surrender the need to control. Your relaxed energy rapidly attracts your desire. So, Virgos, let go of control in your life because, yes, y'all are very controlling people, and I do know this to be a fact. I'm married to a Virgo, so don't think I don't know about Virgos and their actions. I know for 23 or 4 years about them. <laughs> it's about their actions and things, okay? And, sorry I had to smoke. My nerves is bad. I don't care what people says. I know that's bad for me, but they ain't had to live the life I have. And I have lost a lot of people close to me at young age with their deaths, especially my son, and I love him, and he watches over me, and it's telling you to let go, Virgo, of all this damn control, and do some research yourself, you need more information about this situation, look into it further before proceeding, yeah, you got a way long way to go, Virgo, you can't just go off a little bitty whim of what you think, hey, you got the power inside you, use your abilities to resolve this situation, you can do it, as the faith of a child, that's what it's telling you. You got the power to overcome whatever it is you think that you, that you know or didn't know about. And it, you need to do some studying. If you're in spirituality, you definitely need to do some studying. And you need to down get a healthy lifestyle. Archangel Raphael, eat a healthy diet. Get adequate sleep and exercise regularly for optimal health. Yeah, you got to get up off your hind end and do something. And if you like my vibe, hit subscribe. I need to help. And the answers to your prayers and affirmations are fully realized in the winter months. Ooh. So maybe in the winter you're going to start noticing that this healthy lifestyle, if you choose it and you choose to do some down research, because you got the power to go after your dreams and goals and to change change your body if you're trying to change your body, you know, and your weight. In winter, you'll see the results, it's saying. Oh, and you'll see results with children. Uh, your connection with children is part of your life's purpose. Oh, wow, so you've helped many children, you know, and this is what you're meant to do. You're meant to teach others and lead and show others. What else, Spirit? Oh, it says, goodbye to the old, hello to the new. Uh, you finished one part of your life, and now a new and even better part is beginning. So let go of the old Virgo and let the new in. It's what it's saying. And do some research. And you got to go out in nature and can do this research. And take your books outside and study or your phone. And you've got the power to do this. <coughs> and uh, your debt is going to be paid off. The old weight and habit of debt is lifted from you and your life. Thank you, Spirit. And that's going to happen in the spring. In the spring... In the spring of this year coming, 444, I love you, family. Your your debts is going to be paid off, it said. Uh, your desires fully manifest as the flowers begin to bloom. So once you choose this healthy lifestyle and going towards spirit, your debt will be paid off in winter. 
Witter is telling you your wish is going to be granted. What you've asked for is coming true. So whatever it is you asked for, Virgo, it's coming true in the winter months. And uh, children is in your life purpose. So it's telling you to lift up your thoughts and energy to attract what you desire. Use positive affirmations. Say, I am beautiful. I am loved. I know how to get the job done. I am thankful to you, Spirit, because you are wonderful. You've taught me so many things. Just, you're appreciative of everything, you know. Use your affirmations to tell yourself how good you are. That's what you need to do because it involves perfect timing. This is the right time for you to do this. <coughs> You've had to be patient with it, you know. It's asking you to keep being patient with it. That's what it's saying to me. We won't get a different little deck. I'm trying to figure out which one because I put I put a few of them together. Okay, I'm gonna do this one and see what comes out. I'm gonna do this one for you guys, and I done shuffled it. I'm just doing like, I, I put two together. Okay, I like put two together. And what about let go? Goodbye to the old you. Hello to the new you. You need to get healthy. It's telling you. That's what spirit's telling you. Do your research on it. Ooh, green Taurus. You got supreme protection. Your protected cords are, cords are being cut. Move beyond limitation and trust. You need to cut cords with these people in your life so you can get on to your goals and focusing on them, but you need to go out in nature and connect with spirit and the Holy Spirit. See, I love you, spirit. This is about, remember that only love is real. Miracles will occur naturally. Spirit has your back. So connect with nature. You're going to find Holy Spirit out in nature. You've got the power to do this and your debt is going to be paid off. Ooh, you got Isis protecting you. You got magic manifestation manifesting. Your dreams, vision, and goals are becoming reality. So stay focused. Ooh, stay focused in it. Isis said, stay focused. We're focused. And I got a lot of Virgo and Libra teeter. And like it's a cusper energy. Fives and sixes. Five of them in my chart. I could either have five fives or five sixes. You see what I'm saying? It's teeter and cuspus energy. Oh, I love it. And you choose a healthy lifestyle. Maybe you chose to do this in the spring. And, ooh, the universe is with you. Wear a cloak of protection and love. Cloak yourself in a light. See how that little shimmery light is around his sh shirt, around his head. Cloak yourself in that violent flame or golden light or clear light. And in the winter, your wishes will be granted. Whatever you wished for, you know, a cloak of wisdom. Here's another cloak. You already had, know the answer you seek. Trust what you know. So cloak yourself in wisdom and learning more because right up here was the books. You need to study and do that research. Uh, and children is your life purpose, and say your affirmations, because Spirit will bring it to you, it said. Oh, and have the faith in it. Humanity and benevolence, stay calm, trust the good in yourself and in others, and see the light in the world. You're seeing the light in all in the world. That's great, you know? I don't know what yet. It says, I create mindful moments throughout the day, reminding myself that I am love and miracles are natural. See, remember? It does said about miracles will occur, occur naturally. Look at that. It's landed on it. And move beyond limitations and trust. I am the loving energy of the universe. Trust in the universe. I trust in you and I trust in Isis. Oh, yeah, on ISIS and manifesting. Stay focused. I recognize that I have chosen fear, and I choose again. I choose love. So instead of fear, oh, 939, you're choosing love, ISIS. Oh, wow, your debt's going to be paid off. And what about awakening presence? Wear that cloak of protection and love, and I am the dreamer of my dream. You're dreaming your own dream life. Oh, wow, blah, 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 blah. 
And you already know the answer you seek. Trust what you know. The presence of love will always cast out fear. So cloak yourself in love, it's telling you. And it'll, and it'll always cast out fear. And have faith. Have faith in the world. Uh, there is a stream of love supporting my dreams. Ooh, a stream. A stream of love and money is coming to you if you practice your affirmations. Choose this healthy lifestyle. Keep doing your research and let go of that old you. And connect to the Holy Spirit out in nature. Your debt will be paid off. I'm telling you. Now, listen to me. Listen to me, Virgos. I know what I'm talking about. Believe it or not, some of you might be like, she don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I, hell, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I know what I'm talking about. And let me give you one of these. And can we have another one? Okay, you said it. It's saying, you're going through a transformation. I journey within to meet my higher self and find true happiness. So you're needing to journey inside yourself. The answers is already within you. Choose this transformation. 11-11, Twin Flame, I love you. Virgo, I love you. Oh, now listen to this. Choose to go inside and do that research to find, because your spiritual is bringing you your debt paid off. And this is going to happen in the spring and winter time. Trust me. I find peace, security, and contentment when surrounded by nature's beauty. Ooh. Maybe you live somewhere around a huge waterfall and that's your sacred space that's where you'll transform wherever your sacred space is that's where you'll transform into this and find your bliss and your it says then you'll be following a path that you love and you're fully aligned to your soul purpose okay so go outside your where you feel great like never better and that's where you'll transform you need to do this daily and be grateful I am grateful for everyone and everything in my life and the lessons each bring. Do it outside. See, little deers might come around you like they do at my house. 12-12, I love y'all. <coughs> but, yeah, practice gratitude daily. Don't forget that. Don't forget to practice gratitude daily, you all. And let me give you, Virgos, a message. What is a message that Virgo needs to know? Ooh, this is about a past life relationship. You've known each other before. Maybe you're letting go of somebody you was connected to in the past. Or you're all being drawn to each other. It's transforming you. Oh, yeah, it is. You're all genuine, pure love was given always. You're all in love, see? Look at all the flower love and going out in nature. You all known each other before. And... They was some man or woman that was envious and jealous of everything and every person that was in your life. And they will try to insert themselves in your life at every chance they get. They're trying to do this to you people. They're trying to come between Virgo's love because this man was jealous of it. And they started rumors on you. Fuck this person. Me and Virgo says, fuck this person. There's three sides to the story. Yours, theirs, and the truth. Okay, idiots? Rumors doesn't equal truth. It only makes it harder on on us to get out of all the lies and slander all the rumors. Oh, wow. And look what it said. They're so afraid that their secrets are coming out on the internet. They're scared. This jealous son of a bitch is. Yeah, don't worry, Virgos. You're, you, uh, th this was some low-life, low-down, dirty piece of work for sure shit. And they, he didn't care what he had to do just to keep... He just wanted a strong hold over you. That's all it was. And past life relationship. Oh, you could you may be someone who lives in the mountains, maybe the mountain state of West Virginia. Ooh, past life relationship. Oh, genuine and pure love was given. What about genuine and pure love was given always? What about genuine and pure love was given always? Let go of a person who has control over your life, but yet that same person only wants you to be scared and not ask them why they have no trust over their self. So this person you was giving love to, Jimmy, they they didn't trust their self. And it was this envious and jealous man, whoever it was, and they a good pretender, they're a hypocrite. Uh, it's some false political leader, you know, and or a priest, 
uh, is people that you follow religiously. They'll smile on your face in public and behind doors. They'll be a wife beater, cheater, molester, and con men. They're very cunning people that dominates all humanity. They have subtle ways of humili humiliating us without being in the picture. They make us feel guilty and feel unworthy and just make you feel like a piece of shit. And they might even send energy for you to kill yourself, whoever this person was. And fuck that person. Stupid ass rumors. What about rumors, dicks? You were being judged harshly for things that this person didn't even know about you or understand about you or your side of the story. See it? Or your side of the story rumors. They didn't have your side of the story. See, Virgos? Or people connected to Virgos. They didn't have your side of the story. They was just going off blab blab rumors. Blabbly blabby dumb dicks. Oh, and they're afraid that their secrets is coming out. And it could be somebody that they sent a psychopath towards you. This person sent a psychopath towards you to probably rape you or harm you or kill you or something. All because you were strong and you stood up for yourself and you speak on what you feel. And, and, and what about this past life relationship? You may know each other. You live in the mountain states. Because you're all the goats. You're all the greatest of all times. Ooh, look at there. What about genuine, pure love? Somebody wanted total control over your life and relationships. Uh, yeah, because they, they seen your true color shining through. And that you're connected to your animals and aware of, you're aware of things around, you know, because you're healed on the inside. That's how you give genuine and pure love. You learn how to heal on the inside because you're the greatest of all time, you and your person. Both of y'all are. That's why people's jealous of you. What else for Virgo? Uh, they, they're they jealous of you. They want what you have. And this good pretender were wanting to screw your person, Virgo. That's why there's envious and jealous, yeah. And they went around lying on your person. A lot of rumors, and it's all right. Judges and law was listening to it, and now they're going to get judged. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, it says this person is nervous as hell when you come into contact with him. That's why he's so shaky, because he knows he's a starting a motherfucker shit starter. And they're afraid because their secrets come out. They sent somebody towards you to heal, kill you, rape you, steal you, put you in a sex slavery or something, or rob you, whatever it was. But you had a gun. Pew! Virgo's person had a gun to shoot at him, or you did, didn't you, Virgo? Woo, and don't you worry. They, they, they're they seeing that. You're starting to see your hearts of blessings from seeds sown in your past. And you're having whatever you want. And uh, this low-down, dirty life that you was talking about, it was a shady business deal going wrong. So you could have been a job with this person. And they might have signed some contract in your name. But don't worry, greatest of all time, you and your person, Virgo, you and your person that live in the Mountain States, and you're all the greatest of all time, you can't convince people who you truly are, and y'all kept trying to do that, and you're just trying to prove yourselves, but God will show them through divine intervention their new children. Don't worry, you and your person both. You're all the greatest of all time. <laughs> and you're wiping your enemies out one by one. They're planning on, they might be planning on in breaking in or trying to steal or rape you. Now pay attention, Virgo, because they're at down jealous. This man wants to do this to your wife or person, or your boyfriend, you know, take it as it goes, and these people are saying rumors, and you was judged harshly by this shaky, shady ass son of a bitch, and you proved these people wrong, remember I just said about you was trying to prove yourself all the time, now you did, they're seeing just how ignorant they look now too, Ooh, they see how stupid they look, you shaky son of a bitch in the community, they're afraid these secrets is coming out and they have sent a murderer towards you and and you're starting to see your seeds coming alive. Uh, this person is wishy-washy and up and down and, and spirit showed you and ancestors are catching all those nightmares for you with your dream catchers. That you're catching their nightmares sent by these co-workers of yours that you is a shady business deal going wrong yeah a shady business deal going wrong 
Oh, yeah, they were stealing your fucking money. Look, they're stealing your money. See that, Virgo? They're trying to steal your money, your wealth, your public status, your life goals. They wanted to do everything you did. Yeah, that's what it is. Or a person attached to you, Virgo. That's what it was. What's a love message for Virgo? What a message. Religious factors is your spirituality, your religious is affecting your relationship. You got to forgive and learn lessons and move on from that. Don't stay stuck on that. You both can come together even with that. You might be separating or you're getting ready to separate in your relationship because of religious factors and spiritual. And it, it's all right because you'll be coming towards your soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. You've known each other for four this is Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine, and you're supposed to have children together. Ooh. And it could, your love life could be affected by your children. You could have older children, younger children, but the chemistry is off the charts. The chemistry is off the charts between you and your soulmate, and that's who you're, that's who you're needing to go towards. You know, you're separated from and You love them, and y'all need to just get together and talk. Quit being scared and quit being pussy about it. Ooh, wow. I love y'all. Hit subscribe. Here at Pound Star Oracle and get my name around. I love y'all. Thank you, Virgos. Peace.